Say you're sure there are lots more cemeteries out here you're not, that you're not aware of? There yes, there are, there are a lot of them listed as being back in here, and I've heard of a lot of them, but I don't know how to get to them. I see. Uh, this is not an area that I used to frequent with my dad yeah. as much as I did the other areas in the county. Never really knew why we didn't come out in this neck of the woods much. That's probably one of the best examples of terracing that I have ever seen right there. Uh, old style terracing for farming purposes. There's one, two, three, looks like four levels on that hillside. Sure enough. I don't know if it picks it up on, on film on camera or not, but you can see it good from here. It looks like giant steps yeah, yeah. and wow. it was that way on both sides of the road here yeah They like that? <laughs> size of that tree. That is a big old tree up there. Hold on, all the way up to the top. Is it? That's a big old tree. Yes, it is. Hold on a second, I can step in and shoot up myself. That's, cool. That's pretty incredible, ain't it? Yes, it is. In these parts. Yeah, not in these parts. Huh. That's cool. Whoa. You know what kind of tree that is? No. This one that leaves these branches. It's got those little pods. Yeah. Let's pop over, maybe I'll look at that Google lab and see. 
Oop. There's these things on the... Oh, okay. I'm not familiar with those. So we're driving down some kind of road in the middle of nowhere. No idea where we're at. I think this is called Bunkum. Bunkum. We're in Bunkum. All right. Well, <laughs> we kind of know where we're at. Um, there's a. I don't know where I'm at. Dan does. Anyway, just an interesting rock. Just it's a field stone just planted straight up and down right there. I wonder, uh, I wonder where that was. Some kind of old roadside marker or something. Not a grave. This looks like it might have been a home place here. It does again. look like this is a home place here. I believe that's the chimney pile right there. Okay. Yep. And there's an old dead cedar tree. Turn here, that goes to Collinsworth Church. Gotcha. Turn here. All right, now up in there. Now I know it's private property, but there's a house. There's a house back up here. There's another house up here at the end of this road that is just unbelievable. Oh, this is this is Corinth. It's always been the most beautiful place to me. Yes, it is. And tell me where we're at again. This is Prattsburg. This is Prattsburg. All right. If you look at that and you think about we're out here in the middle of nowhere. Yeah. Wonder what some of the houses look like that are gone. Right. Out in the country out here. Oh you know, yeah. When we, right. when we pass by these rock chimneys and old foundations. We don't know now. There's no record, no recollection of what those houses look like. Yeah. But that's an example of one that's still standing. That is an amazing house. And you don't know anything about who lives there? Not now, no. Because... Yeah, whose house was it? Uh, I think it was some of the Matthews. All uh, this little community was Matthews and the Parkers, and uh, there's another house right up here, the old uh, Brown Matthews place. I want you to go in here and see it. Here's old store right there. Yeah. It's too dark to shoot it. Look over here across the road. Oh, yep, sure enough. Now, this was a real plantation. Yeah, sure enough. That's all the things that buried over there. You around right here if you want to. That, that's a gate right there. You probably shouldn't have any further than that. Remember if that's there used to be a cable across the road there, so I don't know if that's private road or, pri or public. I really can't remember. Hmm. I wish I could tell you who to see out here to talk to about doing something on this cemetery in that house. Yeah. So somebody's living. 